For the third one, we have to determine the cross track position or the cross track error. For determining that, we need to measure. Click the right. Just click the right click. Measure. Point from the estimated or the plotted position based on the bearing of the lighthouse. Click and find the leg waypoint or the or the waypoints we we've created from the start. As you can see, we have 0.96 nautical miles cross track error. It may be caused by the poor weather condition poor weather condition or a strong current for the port one for the calculations for the calculations of two for the two depth 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 of the water depth like this we have a 55 and 60. To compute the average depth of this, you need to add the these two icon of depth. For example, 55 photometers plus 60 photometers is equals to 115 photometers. To get the average, you need to divide it by 2. So you will get a you will get a 67.5 photometers for the second one for the sec for the second waypoint we the reason i chose this track because it has a navigable depth of water or high high depth of water for this one, we have 90 and 95. So, if you calculate the average depth of this, 90 plus 95 is equals to 185 divided by 2 to, to get the average. We have 92.5. That's all, sir. These are the, this is the tutorial on how I... How I do the the, the Dover Strait experience. Eh?